Yo, this joint is hard. Yo, hey. I ain't gonna hold you. This shit crazy. It's probably one of the best melodies I made, bro. I ain't, I'm not gonna hold you, bro. This shit, this shit f***ing hard. Yo, what's good? It's your boy T. Will with Team Producer Grind. I'm back again with another video. In this video, what I will be doing is converting a MP3 file or a WAV file into a MIDI file. But look, man, before we get into it, make sure you subscribe to Team Producer Grind channel and make sure that you follow us on all social medias, man. We got some heat coming for y'all, for real. Other than that, we gonna get straight to it. Let's go. All right, man, let's get straight to it. Now, this file that I have, this audio file that I have is one of the voice memes that I actually did over my phone. So if you have ideas on your phone that you want to put into FL, this is the perfect tool. You can use it to convert any of your vocal recordings into midis. You can use it to find the root note of a particular melody. So I'm gonna let you guys listen to it real quick and then I'll break it down. So let's give this a listen. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is you have two ways of doing this, what I'm about to do right now. You could double click on the audio, go down here to the box where it has the visual. You would right click on it and go to edit and audio editor. That's one way you can do it. Or you could just go to the top left of the audio and then you could just go to edit sample. Either way, it brings up Edison. So that's really where you wanna to get to it. So once you get to Edison, highlight just this particular part. And then after that, here's a little shortcut to where if you select anything on Edison, all you have to do is control and delete. It'll cut out everything else and leave the section that you highlighted. But in this case, we're not doing that. So we're gonna actually use the whole thing. What you wanna do is you want to right click and go down to tools. And then it says in analysis, you can convert to score and drop to piano roll. Now, before you do that, make sure that within the pattern that you have somewhere that the file can actually go to so for right now i have it going into omnisphere to this grand piano right click on edison again go down to tools and go over to convert the score and dump a piano roll and it'll dump it just like that that I have it in the piano, I could change it to a guitar or whatever the case is. So I'll use the piano for chords, but I'm gonna use the film harmonic because I still want that guitar. And now because of the fact that I can see the notes, I know what key I'm in. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead on and finish this melody and I'll show you guys the end results. So I'll be back. Mm -hmm. 